The top of the ticket has seen a lot of shakeups and not just because of President Biden's decision to step down. Last week, independent candidate Robert F. Kennedy Jr. also suspended his campaign. But reporter Dana Searles explains why he's still on Iowa's ballot and what the next steps are. Robert F. Kennedy Jr. suspended his presidential campaign less than a week before candidates in Iowa can remove their name from the ballot. But his name is still on Iowa's ticket. My name will remain on the ballot in most states. Kennedy made it clear he is not formally ending his bid and said his supporters can back him still in states they are unlikely to sway the outcome. As of now, Iowa is one of those. And while there is a chance Iowans could cast a vote for RFK Jr., historically it is rare for electors to disregard the popular vote when casting their electoral vote, meaning they will stay true to Iowa's candidate that wins the popular vote. If a candidate wants to remove their name from the ballot, they must notify the Secretary of State's office in writing before this Thursday, August 29th. Yesterday, election officials in two key swing states, Wisconsin and Michigan, confirmed Kennedy will not be able to remove himself from their ballots.